As I previously said, I feel free out here in Balmora. There aren't Imperial Guards all around, reminding me of where I spent my last few months. Thinking it over, I cannot go back to the Imperial City, at least so long as the Emperor Uriel VII has me working for him. Now I'm a member of the Blades. I vaguely remember hearing of this organization when my Imperial father was alive. All I knew was that they serve and protect the Emperor, but talk of them wasn't common among citizens of the Empire's capital. Now I'm one of them. I don't know exactly what they are or what they expect of me to do here in Vardenfell, but I do believe that I'm here for a specific reason. The fact that I am Dunmer and was originally from here might have something to do with it. If the Emperor decided on any province to send me, Morrowin would be my first choice. How fortunate for me. My orders are to join guilds and find work. Maybe they want me to seem like I'm just another Dunmer returning home? What could be watching me? What enemies are there that the Blades are concerned with? I thought the Emperor controlled all of Tamriel, so something here must be troubling him. As to what that is, I'm at a loss to say. Sevelo, Othan, and De Nilla Vallis, former egg miners and local troublemakers, are poaching eggs from Shulk Egg Mine. Report back to Adis when they're dead. Adis Fire, or whatever her say name is. Words. The Nord who is in charge of the local chapter of the oh. Fighters Guild. Say your piece or stand aside. Not now. Go away. Uh, you're supposed to be a merchant, are you not? I like your guar. What's he doing here? Don't just rush on past because you will surely regret it later, my friend. Niemand has it all. Alright, let's see what you have. Sometimes these p traveling merchants have good items. Well, steel longbow and a steel long sword. This is slightly enchanted, but it's an iron long sword. And I have a just a training bow, basically. A kite and short bow. Steel long bow. And a steel long sword. Much better. Alright, thank you very much. When the enchantment wears off this, I'll just sell it and then use the longsword. But, right now, that steel longbow is much better. All right, we're off to find these egg poachers. Unfortunately, if get any directions from Balmora, Quama queens lay the eggs, and the Quama workers, and uh, warriors work alongside her, defend her, and take the eggs to where they need to be. There's no. The prey approaches. Local troublemakers. I remember. Hearing that there's egg mines all around Balmar now. Could be that way. Very foggy still. I have no idea what time of day it is. It's got to be in the evening. Balmora has egg mines all around it. Vardenfell has uh, plenty of them. I couldn't tell you where they all are. I'm from Vivic City. At least that's where I grew up. Another scrib. I wonder if this is the mine. There's a f I, yeah, I thought I saw a campfire in the distance. Let's go talk to these. If they're not bandits. Not dressed in armor. Hello? I really don't have time for this, so make it quick. Hello. I'm a miner in the Shulk egg mine, but I'm getting some fresh air. I must have found the right place then. Do you know anything about egg poachers? We haven't seen Seville Sevelo Othan and Danila Vallas, but eggs keep disappearing and they know the place. Easy for them to get in and out. Stay out of sight. Hmm. 
Thank you. Anytime you're ready. Just don't keep me waiting. The Outlanders doing our work. I've never been in an egg mine before. Now I regret not bringing a torch with me. This is what the eggs look like. Is this a worker? Well, it's not attacking me. Oh, one of these. <laughs> Tough little thing. There's some kind of arthropods, these Quama creatures. Alright. Oh. I guess that's what I'm going to be seeing all through this mine. Better be ready. There's another one over there. Aim just a little above so the arrow drops. Yep. Got it. Compensate for the arrow dropping due to gravity. There's a door here. I might as well see what's down here. Oh, this must be where the workers congregate. What do you want? Ironic that all the people actually legitimately you working here now's the time to talk. are outlanders oh, heard me say that. and the ones I've come here to stop are What's my this people. Then? Yep, every single one of them is an outlander. I should ask to see if they've seen those two. Whoop. That little thing hurt me. Ugh. Come on, then. Say something or move on. Oh, you're happy to see others. Outsiders in here. While you're in our egg mine, please don't harm the workers. They won't bother you, but Kwama foragers and warriors will attack you since they don't recognize your smell. Avoid them or go ahead and kill them if you have to. Don't worry, the hive can replace them fast enough. Have you seen the egg poachers around? We don't know anything about that. We're just doing our jobs. All right. I'm looking for egg poachers. If you've seen them, let me know, please. At least this will keep me on my toes while I'm going through here. <clears throat> I would prefer to attack to fight with something that goes past my foot. Not much of a challenge. <gasps> Is this them? They're attacking me. Ow, ow. Damn it. Hey, Sweat. Hey. Sure, if they're going to come through that door or not. Need better armor. You will suffer greatly. I think the enchantment's gone on the sword. And he's coming back. He hits hard. You will die. Use 
all my potions up, I will. Die, Victor! <sighs> Newbie mistake, leaving my back open to her. sword. Enchantment really didn't do much for that other sword I got off that fallen wizard. Well, they have Kwama eggs on them. So do I. I took one. This has to be them. I'll just search out this area. Make sure that there's no more. If I had better armor, I could have shrugged off their attacks easier. These must be workers. Oh, is that the queen? There might be warriors right nearby. Try not to disturb her. I've read about the queen. She must move from cavern to cavern. Laying the eggs everywhere. There were, I should go back. There were stairs going up or something. Near the entrance where I came in and fought those two Dunmer? Yes. Let's see what's up here. Why would the workers have allowed them? They must have snuck in somehow. But how did they get in and out without being seen? Well, wherever that door leads to, I'm going to have to look. These workers, whatever company is, owns this place, doesn't put any security up. I mean, they gave workers some spears, but that's probably for self-defense against the Kwama foragers and any warriors they come across. Oh, what is that green thing you sp spat at me? Ugh. Two of you now. I've been here. I think this is the door I originally took, which means this is the way I came in. Thank the Nine that I don't do this for a living. What these... what these people do. I found your egg poachers, by the way. This was the only person that knew about them. Egg poachers. We've had no problems with missing eggs since you took care of the poachers. Well... Sorry, stranger. My time is short, so get on time is short. My patience is thin for all you outlanders being in my my province. Little known f fact to outlanders. Well, ignorant ones like me who didn't receive the news. But some years ago, Vardenfell was a called a temporal preserve. And the ban on settlers ended in 414, so 13 years ago. And that's when all these outlanders, these non-Dunmer, came flooding into the place. 
before it was just all, all Dunmer. In 13 years, so many of them come. I wonder what Vivek City looks like. I hope to be there to see it soon. What is this place? Lucky Lockup. Council Club. What is the Lucky Lockup? That sounds like a tavern. Oh, it is. The indignity of it all. So strange this place. Full of Far outlanders and marsh. Ugh. Hello? You run this What's place? What's this about? Kind of getting used to the fact that Imperial's on charge. It's late, my friend. Why not turn in for the night to one of our beds? Perhaps a mold glass of sheen to keep out the chill. <clears throat> I could stay at Chaos Kosade's place, but I'm not going to share a bed with the man. If he wasn't there, I would use it. I'll stay the night. How about a bed? Yes, we have one available. It's ten gold for the rest of the day. Do you want it? Sure. taken. This must be my room. I have a habit of opening things. Whether, well, when someone's not looking, but whether permitted or not. It's late in the day, I'll sleep I feel refreshed. Hello. Any time now. So you own this place? At your service, I own the place. What do you know about the Kimono Tong? Concerning this, I can only speak to a friend. Hmm. They're like they're like the Thieves Guild, but more nasty. Or dirty. Heard any rumors? I heard there was some trouble up at Fort Frostmoth. Never heard of it? It's on the island called Solstein, north of Vardenfall. Yes, I've heard of Solstein. That's the frozen island up to the north, right? Sounds awful to me. If you're looking to get there, you might check for transportation and cool. I mean, take a boat. Heard about someone in particular? None of the Hlalu councillors live in Belmora. Nileno Dorvane at the council hall is the ranking Hlalu count local. At the Fighters Guild, Adis Firei is the steward. Ethasa Rilvane is the Maragtong steward. Feraldo Sadri is the steward for the Balmoro Tribunal Temple. Sugarlips Habasius, yes, I've already heard about her in charge of the Thieves Guild. What can you tell me about Morrowind? About well, 50% of Vardenfell's inhabitants are Dunmer. Really? The other half are Redgar, Breton, Nord, Altmer, Dunmer, Bosmer, Imperial, Khajiit, Argonias, yes, everyone in the whole all of Tamriel, in roughly equal proportion. Isn't that funny how that worked out? Damn Argonians. Okay, let's report back. Another foggy day. Fighters Guild, the Mages Guild. If I have need of any other spells, I guess that's the place to go. Maybe they'll accept me as a low-level apprentice, since I'm not very attuned to magic. Oh, Outlander, did you want something? No, thank you. What's your story? It is Fire Eye. I've done the job, taking care of the egg poachers. You got both of them? Good. Here's your payment, 100 septums, and we've got some extra potions from our recent raid. Take these, they'll come in handy. Just tell me when you're ready for more orders. I'm ready. We have a contract from the Caldera Mining Company to kill four Telvanni agents responsible for trouble at the Caldera Mine. Hmm, that's further north from here. Tell me about these Telvanni agents. 
four Telvanni agents are responsible for thefts and disappearances at the Caldera Ebony Mines. Their names are Alinu Aralan, Sathasa Nerothran, Foth, Fothnya Herothran, and Elvia. They're hiding in a cave in the hills north of Caldera Mine. When the four agents are dead, report back to me. Take care. It's very likely that one of them is on lookout posted outside the mines. The quickest way to Caldera is probably to have the guild guide at the mages transport you, but it's your choice. Interesting. I'll be Welcome, back. Welcome, friend. So I said, where's the money in that? I haven't really checked the fire fighter guild out. Maybe they have beds here too. I can I can rest here if I need to, instead of having to pay for it. Yes, Dunmer. Hello. I am Hasfat Anatol. Anta Bolas, Drillmaster of the Balmora Fighters Guild. I offer training to the public and at a considerable discount to members of the Fighters Guild. You can train me? Oh, very expensive. I'm alright, thanks. Yes. Hello. Hello, Sunil Rovain. I'm Felania Emiliusis, and this is Balmora. I don't believe we met. Is there something I can do for you? Do you train as well? Yes. I don't really have that much money. What do you do here in the guild? I'm a journeyman. Fale I'm the journeyman Felania Emiliusis, a drillmaster sworn to serve the Fighters Guild. What do you know about Balmora's Fighters Guild? Apprentice, what can be said? We are the few, the proud, the underpaid. Ha ha ha. Can you tell me about the Kimono Tong? The Kimono Tong is the old crimin criminal syndicate here in, Bel in Morrowind. And as everyone around here knows, there's a gang war between the Thieves Guild and the Kimono Tong. I didn't know that, actually. In Balmora, the Kimono Tong hangs out over at the corner club called the Council Club. Watch yourself if you go in there. They're not very nice people. I remember that place. It's right next to the inn I just stayed in. Fighters Guild Charter. I've already gone through this. Any member of the guild fighters who strikes or steals from another member shall be expelled from the guild. Readmittance is at the discretion of the guild stewards. Citizens who have contract with the guild fighters have to dispute many may who have a dispute may appeal first to the guild steward who accepted the contract and second with the authorities of each province. Alright. So I can get in if I break any rules. Back in. Yes. I think it's time to check out more of Balmora. Uh, 